have a happy holiday. Hello everybody, welcome to this game of Dead by Daylight. Today, I got a lot of news to like lay out as to what's going on and then we're jumping right into game. Um, first, tournament got a little delayed because of holidays. I unfortunately could not complete the card set. I need to do one more testing with other streamers. We did one with Polly, King, and uh, Earth to Lydia. The, that was absolutely fun, but pure chaos. I need to tone the chaos down a bit. Uh, so I'll have some new cards tested. The new testers are actually going to be, hopefully, Monto, Puppers, and a third of some other... I have Gamma Lunatic is who I'm shooting for. The, I named them, but they're not guaranteed. Monto said he'd talk to me, so I'll talk to him, but we'll see. If I can get them three together, we're going to try to have some chaotic fun. Uh, so that you can expect next week, maybe on Friday. I need to see what everyone else's schedules. I haven't talked to them yet, so I'll try to keep it on the deal for them. Because they don't know the surprise that's coming their way. Next, the tournament I'm expecting will be available to everybody. And I want it done by the second week of Christmas month. So December. I'm going to be doing my best to get this all to you as fast as I can. Problem though, is I'm going to be gone on Friday and Saturday. So I will not be streaming and I will not be making YouTube videos until I come back. To which I'll be a bit delayed. And then I have a kind of small schedule of things that I want to post to YouTube that are not dead by daylight. But will still be coming in good faith because that's what I do. I make content for multiple things and that's what I'm going to do. So with that out of the way, that's all the news. Um, the, I guess there's some Dead by Daylight news. They're nerfing the archives. They're making it easier to complete the third tome if you've been having trouble. Uh, that was confirmed on Twitter from last I saw. Uh, so if you've been having troubles, there you go, no worries. They might be reviewing the fourth tome, but let's go ahead and jump into game. Mother's dwelling at the Red Forest. I don't think I've ever come up with a really good rhyme for that one, so uh, it's just gonna have to stay that way, because I'm lazy. Anyways, we're playing Nurse today, because she is the weakest killer, and I only play absolute garbage. Oh, hello. Oh, no, we didn't make it far enough. Anyways, uh, the add-ons I'm using are... Um... Oh, you. Gotcha that time. Gotcha that time. Anyways, um, add-ons I'm using are just like, makes the survivor louder when they're in pain for 60 seconds, and then recovery on missed blink attacks. Cause I have a lot of the add-ons, but I just don't use them. So I started putting them on. Well, the, the lower add-ons anyways. Um, the higher add-ons I like to hold on to for when I get to like, try hard red ranks. Uh, because I don't level the nurse up, or anybody for that matter, so I miss out on a lot of, uh... I miss out on a lot of... You know, potential of strength. Like, people always ask me, who doesn't play with add-ons if this guy doesn't? Ooh, dead heart. Nifty! You're kind of rotten, but you'll hide for only so long. Oh, oh, sweetheart, that was a good try, though. I will do a solid try, A for effort. And we'll go, we'll go stop that generator from being done. Oh, overshot it. Oh, who was me? Went a little too far. Now, a lot of people looked at the Leatherface video. Oh, like, what was I on? That video was brought to you by the lovely people over at Twitch. Because they asked me to do a video specifically for YouTube. Just for you guys. And they wanted to see it live. So I did it. And that's the video you got. A lot of people enjoyed it. I'm glad you did. There's someone running back over here. Ooh, just a, just a sliver off. Let's go ahead and recharge my blonks. Where are you going? Where are we going? How far behind? Oh, 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 is that how you want to play? I have the ability to double blink. You will rue the day you drop that pallet on me. Whoop. Oh, man, yeah, no, this is, that was fair. I, don't, I have no idea what the hell happened there. Let's be honest. All right, we need two blinks. 
I did not get two blinks. Where are you going? I heard another goober. Gotcha that time. Woo! Spicy boy. Oh, you thought. But you thought wrong. Whenever you can, as nurse, get decisive struck. Because, you know, you... you I remember so many people said that never happens to me. Just don't tunnel them. And it's like, it happens to me all the damn time because they freaking run into me. And I don't even think he intentionally did it. Ooh, that was a good one. Um, but that that's like, whenever I talk about decisive strike being, that happens to me all the time. The more effective of a killer you are. Ooh, she dead hard that one. That was that was interesting. Uh, the more that you are an effective killer, the faster you kill people, the more likely you are to re-bump into somebody that, like, you've already downed or, or had hooked within 60 seconds. I downed one person, found another, and then proceeded to kill them. God, I do love me some nurses. Oh, let's just go through here. Where are you going? No. Now, she might have the D-Strike. I don't know. Well, no, because I didn't hook her. Because I let her go. Because I chased the other person who did decide to strike me, and then they got her up. Man, this team's going for the hooks. I think that these tones kind of destroy any competitive scene. And I don't mean, like, esports competitive, but just, like, I know a lot of people are on Tome 3, so they are going for the 15 or 20, I think it's 25 or 15 uh, saves. And uh, when they're going for these saves, it's just kind of like... Twice. I didn't tunnel her. I just bumped into her. No. No. Bullcrap DS. It's not powerful! Bullshit. How many times I get decisive struck already? At least I only got decisive struck once back in the day. And hit like twice. Anywho, yeah. See, people are just going ham for those saves. They don't even care. Just run decisive strike and borrow time. And I just saw another person. Are you even working on gens? Like, uh, no, you're just dead. Okay. Hi. And you already used your decisive strike. Oh. Well. That's fair. I think I just saw it move. <laughs> saw the grass move. And whoop. All right, that's a four man. We good. Nurse is the weakest, which means when you are playing as Freddy, it should be constant for a game. I'm giving Freddy a lot of shit. He's actually not a bad killer anymore. But I mean, he's been such a bad killer for so long, you kinda can't not give him shit. Well, I hope this increases the nurse's numbers. Oh wait, no, because they won't count it because I got a disconnect. Maybe that's why the nurse's numbers are so bad, because everyone just disconnects against her. <gasps> did anyone think of that? I want to say I did it first. At least I pipped this time. I wasn't going for the grab challenge. I usually do those on stream. Um, he barely made it. If I if I if I had to break down the build for you guys, uh, hex ruin is a staple in every killer's build. If you don't run it, that's fine. You know, just make sure that you are compensating for the fact that they will all be professional gen <laughs> technicians. Um. Thantophobia and Sloppy Butcher, again, it's a combination to slow the game down, so you injure people, and because you're a nurse, you have the potential to injure multiple people. It's very easy to just teleport from one person to the next person, back to another person, and Sloppy Butcher keeps them injured. And you don't need a higher level of Sloppy Butcher either, you just need the mangled effect, and that's it. Uh, nurse's Calling, 
because they're going to try to heal against a nurse, you had like you had seen a couple of times people just healing in the open. Self-caring against a sloppy butcher, unless you have botany, is the worst idea ever. So, sloppy butcher counters self-care, which means they need to run botany if they intend to self-care against your sloppy butcher or even heal others. Sloppy butcher is a massive waste of time. And then Thantophobia just stacks on to wasting time. And uh, the nurse is calling. If if they're trying to heal, you can find them. Uh, you could run Pop Goes the Weasel instead of nurses to effectively maximize your gen control. But realistically, nurse is the only killer with the pressure enough to go around and stop generators. So, you know, make it happen. Look at that. Look at that. Look, look at that. Decisive strike. Decisive strike. Does, does anyone see anything wrong with it? People told me you don't see this anymore. Red rank decisive strike. Red rank decisive strike. Low rank decisive strike. Dude in the middle, I I think, to be honest, I've seen a lot of streamers run uh, Tenacity, Unbreakable, but I've also seen them run Tenacity, Unbreakable, and Decisive Strike, so uh, that that's something I've seen. But uh, I, I've been seeing Tenacity and Unbreakable happen more often. Um, but no, if you play a nurse, you should have the most control out of any killer, so uh, being able to dish out damage, apply your Thantophobia, nurse is calling. Um, the reason I'm giving shit to Decisive Strike so much is because I made a video that, uh, talks about, like, how overpowered it's become. And it's just like, everyone's like, it's never used. I, I honestly don't remember a game that I haven't had at least one Decisive Strike in anymore. Uh, back in the day, you know, it was kind of the same thing. Everybody still ran it, but one person got to use it. Just one. And... That was nice. I got decisive struck three times here without tunneling. I definitely swapped targets. I definitely hooked someone else. I definitely moved on with, you know, what I was doing, but I was just doing it so effectively, uh, it, it punished me for it. And um, hopefully that clears things up. So did I have fun? Uh, three decisive strikes out of five. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I will see you after Thanksgiving break, and we'll hit the ground running with all sorts of content we got coming up in the future. Or your Christmas gift early. I'm going to let you peek. I'm going to finish the Dark Times video. I said that a while ago. I've been holding off on it. I think because it'll be a good end of the year, just start the next year fresh, I'm going to jump on that. Because I also will be checking out last year. I will also be checking out Project Resistance. I will be checking out a lot of new games. Just to check them out. Whether I jump ship, that's for the future to tell. Uh, but, yeah. No, no intentions of leaving Dead by Daylight for a bit. A lot of people uh, look up to some fun and uh, need the numbers. So I'm here to help. And I'll see you all next time. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, good game. I really gotta stop rambling, I'm sorry.